And now, your KRCG 13 Storm Vision Forecast with Zach Evans. It is another very cold start to our day as temperatures are in the single digits and the teens across the area. So you need those winter coats early. It'll be a different story by the time we hit the afternoon. Currently, it's 9 degrees in Jefferson City, 18 over at the lake, 11 in Columbia. The reason why temperatures are so varied is because of the winds where they're blowing a little bit harder. Going to make those temperatures a little bit warmer. Of course, when you factor in the wind chill, feels worse, like minus one in Columbia. Rolla feels like three. Sedalia is at four. Skies are clear, so we are going to enjoy lots of sunshine with sunrise coming up about 45 minutes. This is one of the reasons why it is so cold at the moment. No clouds overhead to trap in that little bit of daytime heat from yesterday. Here's what's going on across the region. High pressure that kept us cold on Monday has pushed out towards the east. That's going to work along with low pressure that's to our southwest to bring us southerly winds. It will drive our temperatures up about 20 degrees warmer than where they were Monday afternoon. There is, however, a cold front just to our north. That's going to move in later today, which we see with the hour-by-hour -hour forecast. It will bring some clouds as we head into the evening hours. But aside from that, we'll be staying dry. Our winds shift to the north. We'll be on the cold side when we wake up tomorrow. And there is going to be some snow in northern Missouri early Wednesday. We're going to start to see that Wednesday evening into Wednesday night, stretching into Thursday morning. A cold front will also bring another blast of that frigid Arctic air. As far as our possible snowfall amounts, not a whole lot. Looks like around 1 to 2 inches for the folks between Jefferson City and Columbia. Between 2 and 3 if you live north of I-70. And then south of the capital city, and this includes the lake area, looks like a dusting to maybe an inch or so at the absolute most. Now for today, we don't have to worry about that. We have sunshine. 41 is going to be our high. Tonight, back to being cold in the 20s at 21. Here's the seven-day forecast. Temperatures in the mid-30s tomorrow with that snow possible late in the day. That continues for the first part of Thursday in the teens to close out the rest of the work week. We're warming this weekend. A chance of snow comes late Saturday, turning to rain as we're in the 40s for Sunday. Then a little bit of rain and snow possible on Monday. 